And we're back with another knife review. Today we're going to be doing the Cold Steel XL Vaquero Voyager. Now these knives have been around for a while. Voyagers have been. They uh, used to be made in OS 8 and then they went to CTS BD1. I'm sure there'll be something coming out next. We also have the large Voyager here in Tonto and then this one here in clip point serrated to show you some differences in the uh, size but we're talking about the extra large Voyager today. First of all we'll start off by reading the specs on this to you. It is a 12.25 inch overall folding knife The blade is CTSBD1. It's stone wash with a hollow grind and it is five and a half inches. Has a plain blade, Fakiero style. Weight 7.85 ounces. Tip up right hand or left hand carry, as are almost all cold steels. It has the Grivex handle manual opener, thumb stud for opening, the handle length is 6.75 inches, it is contoured as you can see here has room for your hand and your pinky in this direction or you can go in this direction This knife will accommodate an extremely large hand. As you can see here, so let's show you how it cuts. We'll give you a quick glimpse of the large, show you the difference in sizes as they sit there beside each other. All right, so we'll start off with a little paracord. Obviously it cuts right through it, no matter how you do it. As you would expect from a knife of this size and CTSBD1, it's going to be extremely sharp. It is also, for a large knife, really accurate especially at the tip and once you get more of the blade in there back to the larger part of the blade you know, it makes it a little harder to be accurate but as long as you're on the front half of the belly the first inch and a half it is an extremely accurate cutting utensil and then of course it'll do the heavier cutting now it's not going to cut all the way down on this board because as you can tell the front of the knife is touching and the back of the handle is touching but the rest of the knife is not so you'd have to bring it at an angle or cut it from the belly let's grab another piece and if you see if you cut from the belly it of course cut all the way down. So you don't get a very good tip cut here because of the way the blade is shaped, but that's not what this knife is for, obviously. Once you get used to cold steel knives, they will be easier to one hand close, as you can tell. But it is something that you do have to get to used to with a 12 inch blade. You don't want to just uh, start trying to close them and open them one handed. I guess the word would be willy nilly. All right, so if you're watching us on Instagram, make sure you follow Atlantic Knife. We have all kinds of great knife content. We do reviews and posts and 
numerous stuff. And if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit that bell and you'll be able to see our knife posts and reviews along with our weekly show, which we like to believe is ridiculously humorous. On that note, I am C with Atlantic Knife, signing off.